Hello, 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 and thank you for tuning on to another episode of our Scripture Breakdown Ministry. My name is David Abraham, and our scripture for today comes from Psalm 7, verse 6. And it says, Arise, O Lord, in your anger, lift up your lift up because of the rage of my enemies. Rise up for me to the judgment you have commanded. I repeat. Arise, O Lord, in your anger. Lift yourself up because of the rage of my enemies. Rise up for me to the judgment you have commanded. Now, I want to divide the scripture into three parts. The first part says, Arise, O Lord, in your anger. This was the psalmist David in his meditation. And here he was bellowing up to, up to God. Here he was sh- shouting out to God. Here he was praying up to um, God here he was presenting a request up to God here there was his heart was grieving and he was presenting his heart pouring out his heart to God he says arise O Lord in your anger that means in anger of God that is arise not only arise O Lord but come in your anger come in your wrath because my enemies have tormented me my enemies have persecuted me so much my enemies have been on my case too much so he said arise in your anger with the anger of god comes wrath with the anger of god comes the consuming fire with the anger of god comes the lightning of god with the anger of god comes the flood so he said arise O lord in your anger lift yourself up because of the rage of my enemies his enemies are raging, his enemies are screaming, his enemies are shouting. So he said, lift up yourself because of the rage of my enemies. That means God should lift himself up above the rage. Because the Bible also says that, that when the enemy comes in like a flood, he said the spirit of the Lord will lift up a standard against them. So he said, arise, O Lord, in your anger. Lift yourself up because of the rage of my enemies because of the rage of my enemies lift yourself up he said rise up for me to the judgment you have commanded that means god had commanded a judgment god had issued a judgment upon the enemies of david so uh, but david was not seeing the implementation of the judgment upon his enemies so he was here arise O oh lord my God, in your anger, then say, rise up to me, for me, to the judgment you have commanded, to the judgment you have commanded upon my enemies. So here he's beckoning to God, he's appealing to God, he's crying out to God, he's bellowing to God, he said, arise, O Lord, and rise up for me to the judgment you have command, commanded. That means let the judgment begin to be implemented. Let me see the manifestation of your judgment upon my enemies. Let me see the fulfillment of my heart desires upon my enemies this minute, this moment, this hour, because you are God, because you are the God of all flesh, because you have a reason above my enemies, because my enemies have troubled me for nothing, because my enemies have been on my case for nothing, because my enemies have tormented me for nothing. Now I want to pray that God is able to expound our minds on this word. That God is able to give us more revelational knowledge. That we may be able to walk with it or run with it. That God will always arise in every situation. Be it challenges. Be it down times. Be it sad times. Be it situations of poverty. Be it situations of of um, penury, be situations where there are challenges, be situations where are not favorable in, in any way that God will arise in those situations to deliver us from every dungeon, to deliver us from every problems, to deliver us from challenges, to deliver us from the claws of the wicked one, to deliver us from captors, to deliver us from the claws of demons, to deliver us from the association of demons, to deliver us from sickness, to deliver us from ailments, to deliver us from iniquity, to deliver us from infirmity, infirmity to deliver us from everything the enemy has done to keep us spellbound to keep us stagnant to keep us in one position without moving from everything the enemy has done the lord will deliver us 
the Lord will deliver you and the Lord will deliver me. All this I ask through Jesus Christ, our Lord. I thank you so much for listening. God bless. God bless. In Jesus' name. Amen.